Psalm 130 Why does the image I have taken on mislead me? Why am I a stranger to virtue, committing repulsive deeds before God who sees all? Justly did the Pharisees suffer to have their errors exposed by Christ the Savior, who labeled their appearance as hypocrisy. And I deserve such reproach most of all. But when my conscience exposes my errors, I become indignant, for the truth is bitter for those who desire just to make an appearance rather than being. Indeed, if one were to peel away my appearance, he would find worms inside. If the whitewashed cover is removed, every one will see what lies in the grave. However, let this not be brought out into the open here. Surely the fire will try all and discover what I am at the judgment. Woe is me! How will I endure the exposure of my lawless deeds and thoughts? Have mercy on me, O God, according to thy great mercy, and according to the multitude of thy compassions absolve my iniquities. Hearken unto me according to thy goodness, O Master, and reject not my supplication. For thou dost not cast away those who truly repent. It is true that even my repentance is impure, for I spend one day repenting and two offending thee. But send my heart fear of thee and confirm my soul on the rock of true repentance. May the light of thy grace overcome the darkness that is in me. Condescend to my prayer, O good Lord, not because I am correct, for in me is no good, but according to thy compassion and thy great and unutterable goodness. Raise up my members shattered by sin, enlighten my heart clouded by evil desire. Save me from my sinful habits, that the adversary may not overthrow me in the end.